Yeah, today we are going to start our part two for the shell input output redirection and filter. So based on the demand, I have to quickly do a series for this so that everybody can benefit. So please, I want you, please, I'm begging you, please subscribe, share the content and like so that we can build our algorithm and also encourage me to do more of these videos for everyone in the in the community. So please let's read the instruction. The instruction sheet we should use V and also we should use Ubuntu 20.04. Then we should use the, the, the all our script should be exactly two lines. Okay, this is what we use to check it. Then we should use this as our first line for our script. Then we should create a readme file on the root directory, right? Then what do we do next? We make sure all our files are executable. So check the quiz question. I've done it. Check it is there. The, the video the video is uh, on the channel. So check it. You see it there. So let's quickly address this question. Say so write a script that prints hello world followed by a line, a new line to the standard output. Okay, that's the question. So what do we do now? First of all, we if you we have this repository already that we have created, we copy it, we copy it, we go to our sandbox. This is how you open your sandbox. Okay, you click on it, web terminal. Okay, web terminal, wait for it to load. Then okay, it's there. Then you press CD, then you paste the 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 the, 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 the file the, the, the repository name by pressing control A plus control A V to paste, then you enter it. Then we need to create a the the directory for our for our, for our exercise, right? So this is the name of the directory. Make sure you copy it, copy it, copy it, copy it. Then you come there. You make to make directory is M K D R I. Make directory. Then Control V. Okay. Directory is make. Then we cd into the directory. We enter into the directory, right? Control A V. Press Enter. Now you can pwd to check the file part. Let's see, we are inside the directory, right? You can see we are inside the directory. So what do we do next? Now we copy our file name. Okay, our file name is this is our file name. We copy it. Okay. Then what do we do? You remember we are going to use V to answer this question. So you type VI. Sorry, before then, we have to create a readme, a readme file. So, how do we create a readme file? You type echo if the comment. My um, what is, what is this exercise? Zero, zero, two, sorry, zero, two, shell. Compute, compute, attribute, direct. Let's input that to direct. Let's do direct and trying to make it long. Okay, and the uh, filter, uh, filters, directions and filters, directions and filters. So that is our comment. <clears throat> so that we can see it anytime in directions and filters. So it should be our comment. So for the purpose of this example, make it like this. Then uh, so it is this input output to direct and filters will be fine. So so that you can remember anytime you see them. You save it inside a file. Remember how you save? So you, you save it inside this file by redirecting it to this file name. What is our, what is the file name? You save it. Me. Dot md. Right. Then you save. Okay. Yes, we save. So that's ls. You see now. You see the readme inside. You can see it's there. So what do we do next? The next thing is we go to our V editor. We can also create this readme file inside our V editor. But I just 
Like, okay, if you want to do that, this is how you do it. You just say, read me. Read me. Dot MD. Sorry, dot MD. Okay. MD. So if you enter it, you can see it's taking us here, right? It's taking us into this place. What do we do? Well, this, this is the com this is the this, this what you are seeing here is what is the comments that we, we put there. Okay, this is the comment. So for us to edit it, you press I on your keyboard to edit it. So this is just part of the exercise for everybody that is going to do it. So you just put your uh, um, you by enter v by entering v you have automatically created that file then this is the comment you just type in your comments here you can, you can put your double quote then after when you are done press escape press shift colon x then you enter take it by close the v environment right so now our next question is what we want to we want to create the hello question which is this one so we have created the v you can see from the instruction we have created this now the next thing is to create this uh, copy this uh, file name the answer this question we are going to what print hello world okay so we are going to print hello world to the screen so what do we do so now we, ha we have input our v you can see we have typed in a v the file name that we want to work on then you press enter okay now you press i on your keyboard to enter in search mode when you press i you are now in the search mode if i scroll down you see that we are now in search mode, right? So let me reduce my screen so that you can see it. Let me increase my screen so that you can see it. You can see that now we are in search mode, right? Yes. So now what, what is the, the question? The question says we should type a first line. The first line syntax is what? Is hash exclamation bin bash. Okay? Then you enter it. Okay? Then when you enter it, what is the next thing we are going to do? The next thing we are going to do is to put the command. So what do we do is echo, echo, hello world, hello world, hello, world. Yes, so that's the syntax. Then what do you do next? You press escape on your keyboard. Then this is on Windows. Then you press shift colon X. Then you enter it. Okay. When you press shift colon, sorry, yeah. Shift colon X, then you enter it. Right. Okay. Now I have to reduce this by this. Misbehaving. Okay. Mm -hmm. is misbehaving. So I have to enter go back to our search mode. So we will close this key. So you can see that we have returned back to the you let's clear the screen. We have returned back to the to, the, to uh to our work environment then the next thing we are going to do to check let's put the list this is you can see we have this is what we have done then what we are going to do next is to make it what um executable how do we make it executable we are going to type this command say chim chim mode chim mode u plus x plus x then sorry uh, let's work to make operating uh, terminal so you type in the file name, you enter it. Now if I LX, you see that the color will change. Are you seeing it? The color change because I make it executable, right? Then what do we do now? We press git add all, add all. Okay, we add all. Then you press git commit and uh, the your comment what is the comment we just put the file name as our comment right then enter it and push it on pg3 
voila so that is how you do it the first question so if you check it from my own end here you see that it's correct okay that is it then you have passed the second question says let me check my time oh, we have to stop here for the number one question okay let me do two so that we can answer two questions in this session so the number two, one question says <clears throat> Write a script that display a confused smiley. Okay, remember the script here. This is what we are going to write. So, what do we do? Create, copy the file name. This is the file name. Copy it. Then, what do we do? We go back, type V. Let's enter it. You can see now. We press insert. You can see on my screen. We press the insert mode so that you can be able to work. I for insert. Then remember to put in your command in dash right and you enter it. What is the command to, for that? You say echo. Remember the same thing. Print it echo. And let's go and copy the, the, the this copy it from here to this place. Okay, copy it. Then you go back, say echo, then you paste it using Ctrl A plus V. Are you getting me? So what do we, how do we do it? We put our input. Then they said it should be on. Let me sorry, let me read the question again. We said okay, I remember it should be on a, okay. So what we we'll do now is we we'll put the backslash, then we we'll escape that double quote. So we are doing it to escape the double quote. This backslash is to escape the double quote. Remember, it's escape to escape that double quote. Are you getting me? Then we we'll put the do double quote again. So this backslash here escape this double quote for us. Are you getting me? So that's that. So if you have done that, all you just need to do now is just to press your escape on your keyboard, then press shift colon X and press enter. The V is supposed to close. I don't know why mine is misbehaving today. So when you press um, my keyboard no responding shift x shift column x then you exit your camera so if possible it's my network that is affecting my whole work today so um this is not a good experience for my viewers so my v is hanging so if i press start now you can see so I think it's my network that is affecting my my timing. So once you press escape, you are supposed to escape from the if you are going to bring the turn you get into command mode, then you press the shift colon and X to exit. So I don't know why my terminal is not responding. It has frozen like this. I don't know what to do now. So I may have to pause the video now so that we can continue. It's so you press you press the once you have done with the syntax you press the escape you press the escape on your keyboard then type the command shift shift colon x and you press it's supposed to escape then you can see on my screen because i've increased my screen you can see then it will take us back to command mode, which is what is blank here. So clear your screen so that you don't have the screen that is affecting it. So we'll go back now. Now uh, the next thing we need to do now is to the next thing we need to do now is to make sure the this LX so that you can see what we have done. This is the file we created, so we have to make it executable now. Which mode mode U plus X. Okay, that's the name. Of, sorry, that's not the name of the file. The name of the file is one. That's the name of the file. Then you enter it. If I LX now you see that it has turned to green, right? Then what do we do? We, we, we commit it. Commit the file. And sorry, we we, we add it to GitHub. So when you press add git add then the the file name okay the file name is this other is the file name then we 
git commit and the, the comment should be the final and close it enter okay. so to enter it so you can see that we have committed then the next thing we do is to push it so the network is affecting my terminal then git push my other videos is not like this so we push it then when we come back we come and check our, if our answers are correct check you can see the answer is correct so let me reduce my screen back so that you can see the answer is correct so i will stop here please go through it watch type make sure you type them yourself and um, please subscribe